major backup on I-35. A portion of I-35 southbound in Merriam remains closed this morning after an overnight crash. Interna uh, inter uh, Interstate 35 southbound closed between 67th Street and Shawnee Mission Parkway. Traffic in that area being diverted, and it is just backed up. It is a mess out there. Lindsay Shively is live near the accident scene. And Lindsay, taking a look at the scout cam there, you just see all of those headlights kind of clumped all together. And where I'm standing, you can see headlights for quite a while. Looks like at least a quarter mile or so just from right here, and then it goes off into the trees. Uh, you can see the ring diverted up here onto Shawnee Mission Parkway, and this is why. Go across Shawnee Mission Parkway on the on-ramp right here for I-35 South. They have blocked that off. People still trying to continue to drive down there, not realizing that it is closed. This happened about 1 o'clock this morning, and really, we think whatever incident happened started up here at least somewhat on this on ramp because our photographer saw a boot of what could belong to the motorcyclist on the on ramp. Some significant skid marks there. And then where the truck and the motorcycle were sitting was way down I 35 South, probably the length of a couple of football fields. All we know that happened so far is that a UPS semi truck and a red sport bike somehow collided and a person is dead. We saw the driver of the UPS truck, we believe, sitting on the side of the road, just visibly so upset by what has happened. We haven't heard what could have caused that crash. We also don't know who the driver of the motorcycle is. We did just talk to the Kansas Highway Patrol, and they tell us they are finishing up their work here, and they do hope to have this open very shortly, so hopefully before the bulk of the rush hour. But as you can see, whatever rush hour has come through is really being impacted by this. So we're going to stay here and let you know as soon as I-35 South opens up, at Shawnee Mission Parkway. For now, we're live. Lindsay Shively, NBC Action News Today.